I'm back. So. Uh, <laughs> sorry for cutting it short earlier, but. Uh, I had to get ready, and I got done dealing with that animal just in time, and the net runner. So. Not to mention that the way I usually go is bugged out, so I had to go the regular way. But hey, what can you oh, do? Fuck, leave Ivan. You wish to talk to Placid? Is that what you want? Be because I can take you. Lead the way. Right, okay. guy you sent to the gym didn't make it looks like you set me up you bought us son i said kid away yes but i also saw his scans he is no ranyo boy a pep new arm we are not safe here Must be Brigitte. Hard woman to find. You have something for me. You know about the biochip, don't you? Yes, and we must check its condition. How much you know from my scans? More than Placid, I'm sure. You recognize the biochip because you were looking for it. We must examine you. If you survive the gym, it is at the chip's cost. Should have thought about that before you tried to kill me. If I was here, the chip would never be in danger. If it is in good condition, we offer you a fair price. Perhaps more for the emotional toll. Chip's already taken some damage. That's why I'm here to begin with. It does not function. Not that bad. Problem is, no one I've talked to can yank it out without risk of death. As soon as you commission the thing's theft, Figured you might know a way to help. How do you know all this? How did you find Evelyn this? Parker. Name ring a bell? Ah, the doll. The whore. You found us because she led you to us. She has proved not completely useless after all. Listen, can you help me or not? Yes, of course, but not here. We will go to the crib, where you must give us access to the chip. Once we have the data we need, we will do our best to help you. Seriously? Haven't done enough for you already? There is no other way. To remove it, we must first examine it. Because if you fuck up, you're left empty-handed. That it? I gave my word. We will help you. Then, after you.
you guys sure seem to love this place. But honestly, you don't give off a strong religious vibe. We left our gods on Aiti, yet we are strong here without them. This way. So how come Placide didn't know about the biochip? He didn't recognize it in the scans. Few of our people know about Compeki Tower. But Placide, he is. Your bet de ba. I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> Where are we going? Soon you will see. <coughs> oh. The watcher did not notice the biochip in you. Strange. Never gave him a chance. Good. It would complicate our work. This an old subway tunnel? No, part of the transcontinental maglev system. When all states were connected. Like the net, it too crumbled after the war. Of course it did. View a courant. Bon. We take you into the cyberspace. No better place for you to interact with the construct. Guess all this means you got your own synth tech interface. We have our own versions of all. We do not use anything from the city. How do I know I'll come back? Do I get some guarantee? You will be inside our data fortress. Under watch. Under your watch. If you knew what is out there in the cyberspace, you would not be so choosy. How's all this any different from plain old net running? The interface show you the data layers direct from the net. Readable, of course. But the basic runners see is only a map. They cannot see beneath the surface. Their tech, it is too weak. Okay, hang on. I want to know what you need Silverhand for first. We wish to contact Alt Cunningham. We know she and Silverhand were close. Alt? The relic which Arasaka held close. It is our only lead. Alt Cunningham. Heard of her? Oh. Where? From who? From Johnny. Though granted, not much. Johnny? All right, V. Guess you better tell her. Tell her what? About us. Construct's active. Let's me and Johnny shoot the shit every now and then. Mm hmm. We will look at this too. What? Think I'm hallucinating? Found myself an imaginary friend? Little is known of how an engram might exist within a human's neural network. Tell you one thing, it doesn't shake out well for the human. What's your plan to contact Alt? We tried to cut out a unique piece of Silverhand's engram from the biochip. Alt will know it. If something of the human is left after years beyond the Black Wall, she will answer. Well, what? You said nothing about breaking through the Black Wall. Well, now you know. Direction yeah. connected. Connection stop. Oh, come on. Not the tub. We must prepare you for the dive into cyberspace. You are not accustomed to the neural demand. Don't try and get out of this, V. Just do what she says. I'm not about to sizzle with you. Johnny, looks like you're the bait. You okay with that? Yeah, whatever. Just do what she says. What exactly do you want from Alt? All of you. Alt, the only one, can give us safe passage past the Black Wall. When the change comes, we wish to be on the winning side. The change? When the Black Wall was built, everyone think the ice would be enough. 
keep the wild AIs out. We wait. But technology advances. It cannot be stopped. And now, catastrophe come again. This is sure. And soon. The corporations, they do not see the danger. But we, we will be ready. The Black Wall. What is it exactly? I mean, I know... You know only what the Netwatch tell you. The final bastion against the post-war AIs. The great victory of humanity over chaos. That would be your Saturday morning Netwatch propaganda. But the Black Wall is an AI itself. The boundary condition let no thing pass through, either way. If the AIs thought like people, they would call it a traitor. <sighs> Let's do this. Okay. What now? Johnny? Il paraît. Paré plongé. This is our BBS, Data Fortress. Bridge to the Deep Net. It's... It's all so alive. So real. Cyberspace moves, breathes at all times. The interface will adjust the ebb and flow of data to the capabilities of your brain. But you... You are an exceptional case. Seeing something more than I am. Yes, the cyberspace, it is always trop belle. So, what now? We can begin. All is ready. We enhance your link to Silverhand's neural network for a short time to grab the fragment. We must find the data on Alt. Alt alone. This should only take... Ready? Last two 
hamburgers? The hamburgers? Sure. You know exactly yeah. why I do it. No, nah. To piss mm -hmm. Arasaka off enough so they'll give you a case of deep muscle lead sure, poisoning? God. But I'm the only one with a vision. So unless you got a better one, like I said, go fuck yourself. Oh boy. Fuck. Is it the concert or Carrie? Hmm? Said you weren't coming tonight. Not if I can help it. Changed my mind, lover. Look at you. All hot and bothered. Goodness gracious me. Mm -hmm. A damn shame that's that. Johnny. Slow spinning mental cocks. Always got a shit all over it, don't you? Any moment that might actually feel good. Your moment. What the hell not? You can be such a bastard sometimes, Johnny. Man, are you on my ass today? Not just today. How is it subtlety goes so far over your head? Weird for an artist. Things were swimming. What? Change your mind? Eats at my gut. Cause you knew what you were signing up for. Look, if you were just another charismatic, narcissistic douche canoe running around after his dream with his head up his ass, I couldn't care less. But it's all a lie. That concert, samurai, all of it. A ginormous fiction. You're not a rocker boy, Johnny. Face it. Ought to join the wired wackos on the corners, frothing at the mouth as they scream death to Arasaka. I see. Think you've seen through me, do you? You know exactly what I mean. Look at you, faking it even to yourself. <laughs> Probably what you're best at, faking it. Mm, you're afraid. You and Carrie both, cowards. I alone have the balls to stand up to Arasaka, and boy, that terrifies you. All of you. Of course, Johnny S. Misunderstood by all Night City. That's it. That's the problem. I think we're done for the day, so you can fuck off. Don't get it all over the remote. See, I Daddy thought... Daddy will be pissed. Hear me? Did you hear me? Hello? 
Not another goddamn word, okay? Just don't shut up for once. Eat, eat it. You're and fucking then, hopeless. You don't know fuck all like about it. me. This is all we have, all we are. Where are you going? Got somewhere to be. Silverhand! Hey! Good Come on, I'll walk you home. Ran out of boosters, didn't you? Can't kill because there's woods. So how long you think you're gonna be mad? Down the rebel path. Last time. You. Let's get out of here. Join us for a drop, Silver Rocker. Fuck off. Whoa, a short fuse on this one, huh? Go, run! Hey, where do you think you're going? Fuck off! Leave me alone! Johnny! No! Come on, rise and shine. Been a while, Johnny boy. How long did you say? Two weeks since I last cobbled you up? Man, did I miss you. Ah! Bullshit, you gonk son of a bitch. Didn't even bother to call. You were supposed to be back for your follow-up. Kid's like a son to me. So I see. How's it look down there? <laughs> well, shove so many tubes up your ass that you're about two mods off from pissing espresso and milk froth. Also tossed in a synthetic liver. Old one was looking worse than a paper bag full of shit. Great. Now I can live forever. Just as well. Where's Alt? Where's who? Woman who was with me. He brought you and you alone. Fuck, they grabbed her. Nobody saw it? Ask your savior. Said his name was Thompson. Arasaka, wasn't it? Uh, it's always Arasaka with you. Cause it always is Arasaka. We gotta talk. All right. It's spitting glue, but she's holding tight. Get some rest. Even a few hours, that the stitches set at least. Uh-huh. Johnny. 
Ah, fuck it. You won't listen anyway. So talk. They wanted her. You. He was just home. And you just stood there, dick in hand, gawking and dreaming of tomorrow. Would have shredded us both if I jumped in. You see the guy's reflexes? Course not. He was that fast. Tech like that, you don't find in a dumpster. Got lucky. Lead panned out. Got some preem footage. Too bad my lead got tossed in the back of a van and sped off. You, uh, aim to do something about it? She was your output, wasn't she? Not your fucking business. Hmm. Not sure, huh? Yeah. Heard there was tension. Sort of goings on. Honestly, could not care less about your fluttering hearts and loins. I want to know why Arasaka bagged her. Alt's kidnapping. It's collateral shit. They swiped her to get at me. You even know what she does for a living? Girl's one of the best runners around. So? One of how many? No. Only linked to Arasaka's. The fact that Johnny Silver and boning her. And she's been working for ITS lately. Wrote some real smooth black eyes for them. Not to be duped in either sense of the term. Arasaka wants her. Abduction was a standard intercorp extraction. Nothing more. Hang on. Alt was gonna meet you tonight. Mm-hmm. Said you could use my help. Wasn't kidding. Sokka tried this before, you know. Except Alt got lucky. Slipped through their mantis blades. Telling me she was afraid, and she went to you. Yeah. And frankly, I'm starting to see why. Okay, so what are they after? Soul killer. An AI. Sound familiar at all? Of course. Urban legend with the shittiest name ever. It's no legend. Soul killer's real. And your chumbas at Arasaka just hired the runner who wrote it. Take that in. Sokka with Soul Killer to do with as it pleases. Grim, my man. You even imagine that, Rocker? Our Sokka will be unstoppable. Soul Killer will flatline any Cool. Run Tell me the rest on the way. Do I hear extreme doubt? Oldest, tritest tale in the world. Our Sokka was out to provoke me. And it worked. So what'll it be? Coming with? Where to? Arasaka Tower. To grab Alt. Right back. Just you and me? You out of your fucking mind? Swing by the Atlantis on the way. Got some tombs there. One of them is... Rogue. And I forgot the other guy's name. Well, if I'm not mistaken, he's with the avocados. No. be in the car. Can't wait too long, though. You'll wait as long as you need to. Where the hell is Rogue? Sit. Stay.
Silverhand. Got an IOU here with your autograph on it. Guess it's your lucky day. Ah, much appreciated. Want a drink? The usual. Please. Fuck. Johnny, give me a hand here. Heard you weren't talking to me. Dunno. Seemed to be talking to you. How about now? Now you can go fuck yourself. <laughs> That's never good. You've seen Rogue? Nope, not today. No, no. Liar. Johnny. Oh, stinks, Angles. Got a private meet going on in there. Rogue back there, too? Yeah, just... Yeah, yeah, private meet, so you said. Promise to be super amateurs. God, I hate this fucking town. Johnny. Don't know you. That's no problem. Just as long as everyone else knows Johnny Silverhand. Need your help. We're waiting for a client. One who values discretion. Mm-hmm. So much so, he himself didn't show. No point in sitting here, then. I got a job for you, too. Urgent, but pays right. How much? But out. This isn't your biz. He's now. Rocker just pulled out his wallet. Don't you get it? He's not here about any damn job. He's fucking with me. Last so time this he... time, you'll be smarter. Take your eddies up front. So, how much, Rocker? It's Arasaka. I'll understand if you'd rather not. If you wanted my attention, you just earned it. But if you're aiming for a friends and family discount, I'm not your man. Corpos, riding in on them hard. You two do that for fun. For fun, but not for free. We leave that to Rocco boys. Pays double your standard rate. Triple it. And you come with us now. Because if she doesn't trust you, neither do I. Deal. That it is. Urgent indeed. Shit, Johnny. Didn't notice you had a fucking tail? Mr. Oh, I noticed. You're coming with us. Here to take me to Alt? Hmm. Just like I thought. Aren't you, Mr. Popular? Oh, hey, boys!
I love this gun. That went well. Let's get out of here. Ready or not, here they come. I There we go. Sons of bitches. Elevator, quick! There'll be anything left to scrape up with you. It's gonna take much longer. Got trouble in heaps. There'll be more at the bottom. Bet you thou. You know what, Rogue? I think he'll probably win that bet. We're parked outside. Coming? Thompson's waiting for me in the car. Media, you wouldn't know. Set them first. And not even a single scratch, I don't think. Now what? Gotta lose him, quick! Next right, take him! I'll park somewhere. Chat. This game is so freaking buggy, it's not even funny. Saka. Alt Cunningham, net runner for ITS. Oh. Yeah. The tower. What's taking her there? This gets better by the minute. How you wanna play this? Either of you donks got a plan? Yep. Distract them. Make some noise. Set up right under Arasaka's windows and crank it loud. Blast the pains out. It'll be a gig to remember. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun.
And they all agree. A psychoactive agent has been dispersed at the site, affecting those in the crowd. All right. Distraction worked perfectly. You recording this whole thing? Uh huh. Why? I want to say a few words to the folks at home. Do what you gotta do. Just stay out of my way. Thompson. Know him well? No. Why does it matter? Don't like the guy? Don't trust him. And medias are bad luck. What? Bad luck. Say someone finds a tape later. A tape of us breaking into Arasaka Tower. Worry about that if we make it out. Come on, we don't have much time. No, I haven't heard anything. We lost couple of a few days ago. Maybe. We don't plan to. Gotta find the main. Get back! Oh shit! One turn taken care of. And that's it. The way you think. Oh, I see why we brought him along. Boom. Better clear the area first. Oh! 
Advise you not to disturb her. What'd you do to Alt? I put her to work on a project of a lifetime. Get out of my way. Alt. Alt, come on, don't do this. Is she? Fuck! Johnny. The hell are you doing? Are you still rolling? This is all we can do now, my man. Show people the truth. Don't change her. She is not. Johnny! Stop that! You have to kill him? We gotta go. Johnny! She's dead. Well, spit it out for you. Thompson. What happened to him? Dunno. Never worked together again. Maybe because you whooped his ass to make yourself feel better. Guy was a vulture. Out to use all from the start. When Arasaka flatlined her, man, for him that was sprinkles with the cherry on the top. Fuck, he would have killed her himself if they hadn't. Just for his cockrod story. The recording. What did Thompson do with it? Did it ever get released? Fuck no. Never even told me half that about all. Really? Any examples? I don't know. That you were a couple? That she wrote Soul Killer? That she's dead? How the hell is she supposed to help us now? As a ghost? She's not dead. Managed to escape. I saw the body. Alt fled. Into the net. Bullshit. Heard more than my share of tales about runners who ran off the Never Never Netland. Just never thought you'd be the next to tell me one. Don't need you to believe me. Long as you do exactly what I say. When did you find out? When she made contact a little later. And? What'd she say? That she was a captain in the Arasaka subnet. But they couldn't hurt her. And she told me not to come looking for her. What? Why? This one time she wanted me to just let it go. Cause enough people had died for nothing already. So... What did you do? Got my hands on two thermonuclear charges. Then headed back to Arasaka Tower. How do you know all it's still around? It's been half a century. But you spent cloistered in Mikoshi. Netwatch could have hunted her down years ago. Oh, they tried, believe me. But their tiny corporate brains can't handle a free AI that knows how people think. They were busy looking for her in the Crystal Palace while she was building the Ghost City for Kang Tao. The rogue went with you. Again. I paid her well. Said to yourself, she was the best. Had her pick of contracts. But for some strange-ass reason, she took a job from a rocker with a death wish. A rocker forever getting his ass beat by Arasaka. Different times, kid. Back then, monks didn't normally sell out to corpse. All you had to do was yell, let's fuck up Arasaka, and every last one of them jizzed their pants. Rogue included. 
Who do boys think they know where she is? Beyond the Black Wall. Where nobody can touch her. Brigitte's primed to go there. Break through. Just to contact the Alt. Talk to her. Too much for our little pro. Sure felt like more than a moment. Saw a good chunk of Johnny's life. And Alt. It is possible. Data connected to Alt are linked to a strong memory trace in the construct. Very strong. These memories must have evoked a powerful emotional response. Then projected onto your consciousness. Emotion, yeah. Plenty of that. Construct, what kind of shape's it in? Enough data is uncorrupted to convince all that it is authentic. What the hell does that mean? So, did it work? Yes. We extract a necessary fragment of Silverhand's Angron. We are ready now to make contact with Alt. First, we must dive deeper. Beyond the yet returned. She made first. So, actually, you've got no idea what's beyond that thing. But we will know soon. In these shapes I'm seeing. Wild, unfettered AI, searching for a passage. I held up my end of ordeal. Your turn. Before you pass through that wall, I want Johnny's psyche removed. We will not pass through. You will take the code to the other side. Fuck. Might have guessed. Never had any intention of helping me, did you? It does not matter anymore. You would bring all to its end. Don't got much for options, do I? Ali. Get to the other side. Brigitte. Let me handle this. Johnny. Came through the Black Wall to meet me. That mean we're good? Things are chill between us? I have recognized your engram code, but I do not know why you are here. To give you a chance to pay me back for getting you out of our Osaka Tower. V, this is Alt. Best net runner Night City's ever seen. Alt, this is V. You need to save his life. 
What did you do with Brigitte? She's still alive? Yes, but she is not needed at the moment. What do you want? This chip, the relic, it's killing me. The construct on it's worming its way through my neural system. I see this, but why is it my problem? Why the fuck isn't it? You created Soul Killer. You handed Arasaka a fucking super weapon that dismantled me, you, and half the runners in Night City. Your death was of your own making. Jesus, Alt, I dove in after you. Gonna tell me now this ain't your problem? It is not. The Alt Cunningham you strove to save in Arasaka Tower no longer exists. This should be obvious to you, as you were responsible for her death. Your death wasn't Johnny's fault. How could you know? Seeing you in his memories, it was an accident. What you saw was his subjective view of what happened. A warped account of events he locked away in his subconscious, and replayed time and again. It bears no resemblance to the truth. You're not Alt. Who are you? I use her engrammatic data. Really? You find this icy bitch aspect in there, too? Mind unloading this baggage later? I wasn't sure what to expect from a meeting with an AI. But it sure wasn't a digital spat. How's that help me, exactly? That didn't make it any worse. Okay, I get it. You hate Johnny's guts, but what about me? I cannot help you. Can't or won't? Can't. To attempt to do so, I would need access to more advanced technology. Interesting. Brigitte claims she alone could help me. The Voodoo Boys deceived you. Why am I not surprised? Of course they did. Fine, so how about Mikoshi? That advanced enough for you? If I could gain access to Mikoshi, it would cease to exist. Good. We can work with that. We'll get you inside Mikoshi and you'll help V. Deal? Best runner Night City's ever seen can't bust into Mikoshi on her own? I am a well-known threat there. They have a layer of black ice with my name on it. Literally. Kinda like a custom-made prison jumpsuit. I refuse to be caged in there ever again. What can you do for me, exactly? With the Soul Killer resident inside Mikoshi, I will create a construct of you, then disentangle your neural network from Johnny's. I shall then inject your engram back into your mortal form. So, you'll save my life, but flatline me along the way. Your consciousness, neural engrams, will be recorded as data. The rest will cease to exist. The rest? The soul. I did not grant the program its name, but Soul Killer does precisely what it promises to do. Christ, I don't want to listen to this bullshit. V just hops back into his body, right? Nothing changes. Everything changes. You know this well. Right, so we got a plan. But how will you reach Mikoshi? I've created armies that failed to breach it. They were children of the net. There's your problem. We're banking on the human factor. We'll crack a window, slip you into Mikoshi. Johnny, uh, embellishes, in case you hadn't noticed. You don't trust him, which is fine. But you have my word, we'll slip you inside Mikoshi while keeping you out of harm's way. I believe this human factor and I have things in common. So, we agreed? Yes, we are agreed. Find a path into Mikoshi. I shall prepare a program to help you navigate the local net. How will I contact you once I'm ready? This is a BDS address. It will be our secure communication channel. Voodoo boys, what about them? They shall let you pass unharmed. Those were our terms. Good, cause I'm not look cause I'm not working with those guys ever again.
So you managed to survive. No thanks to you, I'm sure. You must not take any of this personally. We seek Silverhand's construct. You are unlucky. Have accident. Get involved. So it's okay to make me the fool? That how you do biz? Maybe I ought to give all the heads up. You dare now to lecture me? No. Waste of time, waste of breath. Thank fuck my biz with you is done. I want nothing to do with you. So get out. Gotta be pretty disappointed. Did what? That you can't zero me after all. It is out of my hands. Did you hear about Brigitte's ask from Alt? Or was that memo way above your pay grade? Like the biochip was. Oh, uh, you tried to provoke me. Is this wise, you think? Bingo. How am I doing so far? or narrating porn. Gee, aren't you funny? Look around. Look what they've done to this hood. This is the part where you divulge your master plan to annihilate Arasaka? No. It's the part where I say I despise petty merc thieves who think they're hot shit rebels after setting foot in the afterlife. Might think you took on Arasaka, but you're just a bug they scraped off the sole of their boot, tossed in the trash. Says the most inept terrorist in human history. Need I remind you how you let Arasaka crush your soul and put you here? A nomad could never understand what it means to fight for the city, die for it. You're a dick, you know. And you're a cunt. Maybe we'll fit together after all. You seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seen flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Honestly, I'm scared of the day I'll start seeing your memories as my own. Shit. If it's a two-way street, I'll somehow have to live with the fact that I let Deshaun best me, fuck me over. So, listen. Will... Will I notice a change, or... Is it one of those things where... I wonder why I ever feared it? Worst thing you can do to a human. Rip their identity out of them. That's all I know. I ain't find life under my skin. Well, most things are either too big or too small. Not to mention the clusterfuck that are your hormones. And the lag between sight and touch. Infuriating. When you take a bite of pizza, it takes ages before I know you fucking burn the roof of your mouth. Plus, used to be five minutes wouldn't pass before I had a fresh cig in my hand. Now I'm itching for nicotine. Getting used to it, I guess. But it's no fucking picnic. Can you just tell me what you want? What you really want? 
Help me settle my score against Arasaka. That's it. Your goal is to bury Arasaka. Demolish him. Mine's to stay above ground. They seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually aligned pretty nicely, too. You need Mikoshi to save your life. That done, I can burn it to the ground. There it is. The Crusade. Get to Mikoshi, smash the system. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and empty pockets. Corps have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. I'd be right. Can't really argue with you there. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Johnny, take a sec. We gotta. Fucking hell. You still don't see it, but you will one day. Johnny. Shit!
Good to see you, V. Seems pretty, uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. What the hell happened? You look close to awful. You see a man robbed of his implants, money, and dignity. Look well. It is not all bad. I am mostly unnoticed in the streets. Friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at anchor in the bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. Sure you can trust him? Yes. Convincing, very. I have nothing to lose. Is that better? Worse, because I got plenty to lose. By God, huh? A good sign. He is usually camouflaged. speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. It was there. Saw what happened. Yorinobu strangled the old guy. Silence! Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about the silly parade? Fool! Correct. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath to do my duty. But you can't ignore the truth! The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. There is a price on your head. I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to Yorinobu-sama. Sorry, but is this gonna take much longer? What would you do now, were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to Yorinobu-sama. Consider yourself lucky. That I am not you. Oh, you can't... Not like we're asking for a whole lot here. Just one brief meeting. Hanako should decide if what we say is true. You can't decide for her. Will you help? I will not. 
But I will let you leave this place, this city, unharmed. If I see either of you again, I will not be so lenient. Be very careful, my friend. We are all so far from home. Good fucking riddance. One hour of soccer whack job is already plenty. Fine friend there. Got any more? Alas, only him. Well, can't say we didn't try. We tried, yes, and obtained something useful. Hmm, how do you figure that? What Oda said, they returned to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see that parade? It is our chance, perhaps, if somehow we can get to Hanako-sama. We must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japan town. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Uh, hang on. Not so fast. It could sound as easy as hacking a schism. You said yourself, Hanako's got the tightest security in all Night City. Correct. That is why I wish for you to contact us with the local fixer. No, we're just a fixer dame. Wakaku Akada runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Will you join me? Sure, why not? Street. What is this name? <laughs> Just a night city name. Beware, you mock me too often. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Only what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Yorinobu and his puppets grin at the cameras and insist that everything is under control. But the wider the smile... You yes. alright, Goro? Why the sun? I'm just asking. Does everything with you have to have an ulterior motive? I apologize. That came off wrong. I am... I am simply not used to such questions. People like me, either we are doing well, or we are in a grave.
Rogue, my sweet. This has got to be a misunderstanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. Well, well, who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Bukako, long time no see. So what brings you here? And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together. That's all. Takemura Goro desu. Okada-san, oai dekite koei desu. Ah, a true gentleman. Ah, huh, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V, bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Eddie's is why. Always about Eddie's, Wakako. You wanna make him? We got biz. Doesn't get any simpler. So tell me, and mark well I still have my phone at hand. Let's start with the Eddie's you already owe me. Sandra Dorset job? Weren't in any rush to collect before. Surely you can wait a little longer. V, now is not the time. Tell Okada-san. What we come for. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka again. What I fail to understand is why come to me? Did Mr. Deshaun not come to the phone? Goro. Remind me why Dex is fat, backstabbing ass is currently indisposed. He is deceased. Butchered and dumped in a landfill by some Arasaka goon. Real shame that. That a threat I detect? No threat, no. Asked why I couldn't reach Dex, I answered. Just facts, nothing more. Good, cause you would then have to join him. Okada-san. Our intentions are honorable. We need just information. It is a matter of life and death. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Okada-san, what is free often proves most costly. Gonna take them or not? For free? You sure? Got my reasons. But patience, I got none. Japan Town. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, the guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japan town. And we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Not at all curious what we're going to all this trouble for. Blissful ignorance has served me well. In any case, I'll find out soon.
won't I? Thanks, Wakako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. We have some outstanding biz to sell. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A Tiger Claw specialty. I can't help asking. How many of those husbands did you have? Five. All went before the time. Terrible family tragedy. You're not afraid that tragedy will strike you? Have to live somehow. For my nine sons. Willing to bet nobody knows Westbrook like you do. My husbands knew Westbrook. Yes. Each of them. Very high in the tiger claws. Ruled Japan. What did they do? They did what made the best eddies. Gave them the most pull, sold sex, and black market tech. All right. A delightful, mature woman. This information, it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Stay safe, Goro. You as well. Until next time.
Who would have thought? The Empress. Again, solve your own problems, clean up you know your own shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Oh, beautiful. Rogue, wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm, not here, not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, and it's really her. Fucking Rogue, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRIs. See right through you. Give her the truth. The girl. What was her gripe? Why didn't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Helmet. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third? Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells. Teapot. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. They knew the risks. All sorts of shit happens. To all sorts of people. Even to the best. To you too, Rogue. Our Sokka Tower, remember? Who'd you lose back then? Johnny something... Ah. You came prepped. Of course. Anyways... Feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm hmm see? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day? No. More like, come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm-hmm. Then see ya. Soon. Soon. You know where to find me. Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. Ouch! You are not cheap. Here to see Rogue. Expecting me. Hey, Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you'd check out. Let's see what you got.
Your Hellman's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Crawley keeping him hidden from Arasaka. He must have worked on a top secret project. Mm-hmm. Hidden from Arasaka or any other megacorp that wants what he knows. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. Data's all confidential. You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But, right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city, and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. A dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus, they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it. Not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them. Or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. Mm. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Navin Helmet. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Hmm. Can't be trusted if her clan banished her. Sorry, just not willing to pay you for help like that. Actually, she walked away. Said it was about the family, its future, nomad ideals, blah 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 blah. I stopped listening a few words in. Thought you preferred to know who you're dealing with. I know enough. Besides, when someone starts spouting ideals, it's probably about something else. Power, usually. Fortunately, not my biz, not yours. Pan Am's capable and stands to help you. That's all you need to know. Seems wonky to me. Nomads give the city, city folk, a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Alda Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty Pretty big big Occasionally, one. Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. <clears throat> Guess I can try to help her. If we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me, too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. 
And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Huh. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. <laughs> no fee. <laughs> Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Ah, oh, finally. Let's get out of here. All clear. Thanks. Good luck. thing between you and Rogue. Couldn't care less. Got a job for you. Good. But I'm overextended at the moment. With the merch and your car? Getting them back? I can help with that. The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. going for V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. 
Agree to help me, you'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car. You go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? One guy I gotta talk to. A corpo traveling by corp convoy. No, I don't do abductions. Besides, you'd need many more bodies and heaps of gear to take a convoy. It's just one AV. Planned route will take it over Jackson Plains. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. You got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Thought this is mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, only thing I can move is pizza. <laughs> Maybe. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirty eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash, you chew me yours? We hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. Fine. Partner. Former. Ever. The shift tricked me. Straightened into my truck and the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Want to tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drunk. Buzz! Hey! Nash is gonna pass you the merchant Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Buzz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Buzz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Give that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. Yeah, trust me. I got one. Who the hell's Boz? Won't cause us any grief, I hope. Boz is a stand-up guy. Sixth Street. You drive for gangoons. Is that not allowed? Street punks need things moved. I need money like anyone else. So... Where to now? The Aldo Caldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. You know... Used to ride with nomads, too. Truly? I never would have guessed. Yep. Backer clan. Back in the day. Didn't work out between us, so I landed in Night City. So we have something in common after all. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. <laughs> it was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so. Yes. Any chance they might help us in Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Good, let's roll. Get in.
Where'd you get the ride? Straight out of some driveway in Rancho? Yes, exactly. <laughs> Is that a problem? For me? No, not at all. I mean, there's no accounting for taste. Screw you. <laughs> <laughs> How far's the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. How the hell did you land in this place? I like the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue? Do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Rogue's queen of the afterlife. Plays her pawns as she pleases. Did you just call me a pawn? I got a good look at her. She rose to the top because she reads people. So what if she keeps things to herself? It's a skill in her profession. Well, I think she's a lying, manipulative bitch. She put me together with that rabbit. Did you know that? Seriously? Didn't realize Nash was Raffin? No. The sneak forgot to show me his ship card. Don't you keep track of who's in the area? The rates, right? Until now, they mostly jumped corporate transporters down by Highway 64. I see you know things. No mad blood. I not have known that side of him. Don't make me laugh. A fixer of her standing knows. And Rogue probably knows we're talking about her right now. Nash and I had a role to play in the game. Her plan. That's it. Rogue's a frigid old bitch. That's the truth. My guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. Scorpion and me. Oh boy. Would you look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Hey, guys. Hello. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. 
This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance, but... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Figure out your differences with Saul. Will you come back? Pan Am, you'll stop by later, right? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So. I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. We can go. Hop in. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul. He your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised to change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Not right now, no. Could just be a matter of time, though. <laughs> okay. Were Scorpion those two Mitch? in the army? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys. Flew those huge transporters. Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. So Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. You hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers.
Okay. We have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins. And we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Doubt Rocky Ridge could be any deader. It's down. Nothing works here. Well, have you found anything? I got nada. You have an epiphany? The Raffins will roll in after dusk, right? We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. No dice. Nothing's up. All cut off. So we plug it back in. Let's check the substation. You got it. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? So classic route. Good old diversion. You know it. First, we don't know how many are coming. My thinking is it'll be a sizable crew. Second, we have to create an opening to get to my car. If they're bunched together, we won't stand a chance. So we give them a little light show at the intersection? Yes. We'll breathe some life into this dusty old town. As soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First, we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Sorry guys, I was I was just thinking about something. Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the black rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am.
which gear's got power. Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. And my thorn. You see her? Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. Not good. I gotta wait for him to turn around. And I'll take your rifle. Still breathe. Better off not leaving anyone to tell the story. It's as if you've read my mind. We have to take out the brutes by the car. One for you, one for me. Well, 
that did not go as smoothly as I want it. If I remember correctly, there was a ladder by that gas station. I should have used that instead of just trying to go for a headshot. But even if I instantly killed him, it still would have gave away my position. <sighs> this is where this is one time where I think suppressors would come in very handy. I don't know who threw that poison grenade at me, but it killed me. Better off not leaving anyone to tell the story. It's as if you've read my mind. We have to take out the brutes by the car. One for you, one for me. Damn it! Yeah, Max Hack are basically walking tanks. Better off not leaving anyone to tell the story. It's as if you've read my mind. We have to take out the brutes by the car. One for you, one for me. Oh, eh, okay, slightly wrong. It's not.
I don't even know why I have this stupid thing out. Three, two, one. Move. I'll take the wheel. Sure, sure. Leave the driving to the pros. isn't she dreamy indeed no surprise you wanted her back she completes me see managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion listen V it's not over yet it's not you got the cargo you got your car I did not get Nash who was not in Rocky Ridge the fucker didn't show and am listen I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got him. Six Street away from Just listen to I... me, for fuck's sake. I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. <sighs> All right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. I know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it, would you have done it? No doubt. Without skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Are you ready? Let's get him. <laughs> I'm coming prepared this time. Oof, too close. Yeah, his sniper can go through objects.
happily take that. If I remember correctly, there's ammo here somewhere. Had to die sometime. Come on, buddy, show your ugly face. Don't be shy. And now it's gone. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, yeah. Get around the middle. Come on. Come on, Jay. Are you kidding me? Oh, that bites. Hey, at least I'm not in the driver's seat again. So that's good. They're on their last squad, asshole. again.
Not gonna hit me that sometimes. way. I'm carrying a sniper rifle. You're carrying a uh, SMG, I'm guessing. Oh! Shotgun. No, actually, no. Assault rifle. Fuck you, I've got some hot take now. Keep the one that I got. Hmm. 
283. I'll take that. Of course. I think that's it. Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit cleaned. Happy? And the 6th Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. I was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Biz while you were out chasing down a vendetta. Fuck! This thing with Rogue. Let it go, maybe? Why should I? Because she's not worth another goddamn minute of your time. Let's go.
Thank you. One bitter cold bitch that broke. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Boss, got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sixth Street not likely to pull anything. I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Sunset Motel, what's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Should be fun. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. That's not a good sign. Hey, boss. Pan Am! How's Nash? Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? Just here to keep you in line. Ooh, got a little more sass than Nash, do you? Wait and see. <laughs> I like this one. There. First class merch. Mm-hmm. Everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Raffin's wiped, Sixth Street's pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. The day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. biz or new friends back there take a wild guess is everything good with you Did those bozos come around again raffins nah it's been quiet they'll be back sure enough but this place has seen worse what can i get you frosif two of them so that package for street what was it you didn't peek valoperidol drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst they trade in them Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers... Well, here's to that thorn of yours. 
Thanks for everything, partner. Damn. Okay. Another one over here. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. The Elder Caldas. Think he'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday. I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? Who would I become if I stayed in Night City? I had to leave my clan, too. Oh, yeah, I remember. Backer family, right? Mm-hmm. Then I came to Night City. Saw my chance. Took it. And? And I lost almost everything. Shit. That's comforting. Let's talk about something else. Anything else. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh, no. The shiver cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. Yeah. After the beat we get them, you're damn right they do. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here, just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Maybe we rent just one room. Good idea. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. Okay, I won't insist. Separate beds. Got it. No, I will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few winks. Starting to feel that stress go away. I'll probably be out as soon as I hit the sack. You had better get some rest too. This is only the beginning. That's the plan. Good night. Mm hmm. Dakota. My name is Dakota Smith. If you're looking for jobs out here, you will find them with me. What nation you ride with, Dakota? The Aldecaldos. But I do not ride anymore. I'm V. Rode with the backers. You rode? Past tense. And now? Now I don't. I see. We will be in touch, V. Oh, what now? V. One of my missing vehicles could be near your current position. Got it. All right, I think I'm going to end it off here.
So, y'all have a good night and take it easy.